let's wrap up with two questions. And these are two piece of, pieces of advice that I'd like you to give. One piece of advice to the publisher and one piece of advice to the developer discovering the API. What would those two pieces of advice be? Wow, uh, good question. So, uh, so for the publisher, I would say I'll be a little, uh, so if you, if you want customers, if you have a public API and you want customers, you should be on the network. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's my first piece of advice, showing the network. Um, you know, there's so many developers on Postman, such a great way to reach them. Uh, there's a good chance if you're not on the network that your developers are doing it on their own and they're creating their own collections to use their APIs. So just go ahead and make, make it easy for them. Advice for our developers? Advice for developers, yeah. Um, that's a good question. So I, I, uh, the network makes it very easy to get started. What I would say is two things. Uh, fork your work. Mm -hmm. It's like the, the, the time you put in to get, to get started with one of these APIs. Fork it so you can save it and reuse it later. Um, and I would say lean in. Uh, as well uh, to it being uh, you know a true network you know there's all these other communities where developers participate and they give back to the community whether they're doing it on github whether they're doing it on slack doing it in a discord uh, you can do that now on postman too awesome um, and so that would be my encouragement to developers because you know they're learning they're, they're they're using the product and they have other developers that you know colleagues other folks need help um, and postman's a way for them to give that help developers have always been an amazingly altruistic community and postman's another opportunity to um, to be helpful